Hello everybody, my name is the Lego Kid 2003. Oh, sorry guys, that was my dog. But um either way, um here I am back again with another evolution custom prototype video. If you remember in the last one that I did, I did a prototype for Magma E Frider. And um I'm just gonna call it like prototype e Frider for now until I get the actual parts. And if you guys hear squeaking in the background, ignore that. But this time we are doing a custom for the ep kind of a prototype for the evolution of Epic e Vibero, which I'm calling Prototype Venom e Vibero, or just plain Prototype e Vibero. And the prototype is e Vibero. To glaive massive and the actual parts are seven glaive orbit but I don't have orbit nor do I have the seven disc so I'm just gonna have to make do with what I have so of course this is a defense type I mean defense layer defense disc defense tip but um, I chose venom e Vipero as the official name because I mean I mean, let's 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 face it. It looks like a, a combination of a dragon and a snake. I mean, it even has the word viper in the name, so it definitely makes sense for the name to be Venom E Vipero for its evolution. But either way, and of course, just like all evolution bays, the frame will come off with a small amount of difficulty. Oh, and there's my cat. So, it's frameless, and in case you guys have not met my cat, there he is. There he is. Yeah, and uh, this is supposed to be family friendly cat. I'm kidding, it's, it's just the cat licking its leg. And who knows where else. But, yeah, so here is... Uh, Evapro 2 massive, and then here's the glaive frame. So let's put the frame back on, go over to the stadium, and go for a test launch. Alright, so here's our little stadium that I use for battles. 3, 2, 1, let it rip. And it spins. I mean, it moves around a little, but in the end, it will end up going toward the center and being all defensive and whatnot. And let's just send in Corbeus Knuckle Unite to see how it, how it acts. See how easy it bursts. Yeah, and D Viper is knocked down. And just a bit of damage is done. Of course, let's check on our little, uh... Yeah, it's, it's pretty... Its opponent is pretty much at the midway. Right there. And of course I chose Corbea's Knuckle Unite because that's a bay that pops up in the show. And yes. And if you guys haven't watched the show, then watch it. You will know why I said that the uh, cost the combination Corbea's Knuckle Unite comes up in the anime. But either way, that is it for our little uh custom prototype review of sorts and of course and actually before I end this let's just see if how well it can enhance spin or spin in reverse and of course me sucking at hand spinning with my right hand I'm just gonna do it with my left and it seems kind of imbalanced but it does take it well I don't know how well it, it'll spin steel without rubber the fighter does does spin steel pretty well even though it doesn't have any rubber, there are points where it will allow for spin stealing, even though it doesn't even have any rubber. But, either, either way, that is all for this video, and uh, pretty soon I will have a kind of a showdown between the two prototypes. So definitely stay tuned, stay tuned for that, and um, comment, like, subscribe, and stay awesome.